Hello YouTube, and today I was just gonna show you a video because I was playing a game of Infected and I got a Moab. Yes, a uh, Moab, a 24 kill streak on the map outpost. I think this is quite a good spot because there's two lines of sight where you can be attacked on, and both of them are pretty straight, straight past, so you're not gonna be close to a corner and an infected guy runs around the corner and kills you. Pretty straight, um, straight lines of sight, so you can pick them off before they even get close enough to aim and stab you. Right now, I'm just um, walking around the map before the game starts because I don't think some people are infected, but like no one's really been dying yet on my side of the map. And things are gonna get really interesting soon. <clears throat> I, I think FMG9 Infected is my favorite type of infected because it's more fun than Type 95 or Striker. I think because these guns are overpowered and they're quite easy to use and get collaterals. Because later in this video, when if three people run up to you and you have FMG9, you can basically, if you spray at them, you can probably shoot through the first guy and do a bit of damage on the second guy. So by the time the third guy reaches you and the second guy, they'll be on such low health they'll die in like one bullet. So it's pretty easy to just get high kills from this guy. But one of the main things about infected is luck a lot of the time. Like luck with you dodge a throwing knife or earlier that stab that guy did at me, I luckily dodged that you saw his knife did could have hit me. And the guys with the knives on us, they have quite a lot of range. I didn't really expect them to be able to stab that one. Well. Like, come on, you guys knew about that. Silence. Yeah, it's really annoying sometimes to spot a few where and how close to stand into your enemy. And yeah. A lot of people would prefer to camp on infected, but I think that's quite a bad idea. Because throwing knives can a lot of people can easily cross the map you if you're just sitting there prone waiting for them to come. And most people won't come that close if they know they're just gonna die. They'll just keep trying to cross map throwing knife you and eventually they will get you and you'll be very annoyed when they do. So here right now I'm just hiding, I think I was doing something at the time, and now I'm back. And a lot of guys are climbing up there. I'm trying to shoot them down as they go, but it's not really gotten that intense yet, as, as much as I thought it would. Really. And if you're lucky like me, I have told you, so I heard the guy behind me so, um, when he stabbed him. And right now, you never walk towards the enemy, always walk backwards when you Don't sit still, you're most likely gonna die. a good alternative um, to not get hit by throwing them. Just, you can only see the tip of your head. It's going to be a lot less likely that you'll be picked up by a crossbow. Right now that was pure luck. Teammate went down and I'm just trying to tip off the enemies as they come. They're pretty much all coming to me right now. I'm trying to do my best to stay alive. Got to watch your back. I made some more room there while she ran down that little car I was talking about. I could easily pick them up. So, if you ever play outpost, you should know I've got a Moab here and I will duck it. When I click the switch, there were just too many and since I wasn't shooting and I was running, I got overwhelmed. And this is the part where I just stopped playing. I, was, I didn't know what to say. My own Moab killing me and everyone else and I don't even get any XP for it. I think I just sat here for the rest of the game and didn't move. But I, I don't really read, I don't like reading. But I just sat here, I didn't know what to think.